Glenda, state leaders facing some really harsh criticism tonight from the people who patched the roads in Oakland County. It stems from the latest vacation lawmakers are taking without a road funding solution in place. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shakehead joins us live from Southfield now and has the very latest on this developing story. Simon. Carolyn, the roads issue has more than just drivers fuming mad. In fact, now the local road commission taking aim at Lansing. At the Capitol in Lansing this week brought unsuccessful efforts to pass a badly needed $1.2 billion roads deal, making things worse. Lawmakers on break again till after Labor Day. Basically, for about 10 years, we didn't buy virtually any new equipment. Uh, our fleet is, is far older than it should be. Now it's not just drivers calling out state leaders in the House. Disappointment. I really hope they would get it done every day. They don't fix this problem. The roads get worse. Tonight, the Road Commission for Oakland County presenting its annual budget. Keep in mind, they get their funding from the state. Oakland County has somehow managed to increase the annual budget to nearly 105 million, but it's still way short of what's truly needed to fix all the broken roads. So instead, we essentially get a band aid for potholes. If you cold patch, even in the summertime, you are wasting money and labor. On the bright side, Oakland County will be redoing sections of Maple Road and Orchard Lake Road in West Bloomfield and Big Beaver Road in Bloomfield and Birmingham. The new budget takes effect October 1st. It's not just an economic issue as far as our business climate and our personal vehicles. Safety comes first. Now, the capital criticism is far from over. Tonight, we learned another county will be holding a press conference next week to address this further. Live in Southfield, Simon Shaquette, 7 Action News.